Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to get YouTube videos on your Windows mobile device. Now, for this video, I'm going to be using, I have a Dell Axiom X50. My Dell has Windows Mobile 2003 Second Edition and everybody knows that in order to watch YouTube videos on your Windows Mobile 2003 Second, edi second Edition device or Windows Mobile 2003 regular edition or whatever you're going to need a program called TCMP now that program doesn't work anymore I mean you can do that mobitube.mobile website thing but it doesn't work whenever you click on a video it's going to say access denied so it doesn't work anymore and you can't just go to YouTube or Google videos because those don't work either they don't they just don't work I don't know why it might work on yours but it doesn't work on mine so what you want to do is open up Firefox or Internet Explorer, whichever one you have. Go to the piratebay.org and yes, it is going to be a torrent download. Now, I'm also going to include a link in the description under this video on uTorrent, okay? So you don't have to worry about it. You're also going to need WinRAR. I'm also going to include a link in the description for that program as well. Now, this program works for Windows Mobile 2003, Windows Mobile 2003 Second Edition, Windows Mobile 5, Windows Mobile 6, and 6.1. Now, if, you're going to, if you have Windows Mobile 5 and 6 or 6.1, you are you don't need this program, okay? So you might as well just exit this video or whatever. Because you see, if you want to get YouTube videos on Windows Mobile 5 and 6, all you have to do is just go to the YouTube mobile website. Under the little um, search bar, there's going to be a link under it that says download the YouTube application. Just download that and install that onto your device and you're good to go. Now for people like me who have Windows Mobile 2003 second edition device are going to need this program. The program is called Core Player, right? Get this version right here because I tried some of the other versions that they have on the Pirate Bay and they don't work. They suck. They don't work. Now this one I already scanned it using my antivirus, I got AVG antivirus. I scanned it and it doesn't have any viruses so you don't have to worry about that and it's got eight feeders so you're good to go all you have to do is just click download this torrent click open with uTorrent don't click save file click open with uTorrent click OK now you can save this onto wherever you want but I'm going to be saving mine, mine to my document slash download you can put this wherever you want check it click OK and wait for it to get downloaded OK it has been downloaded so just about that you can delete the bond I'm just gonna delete it cuz I don't want it here okay just next then we bar click extract here okay you don't need that anymore I don't know what this is for I think it might be a manual or something but I don't know what language is this this is in so I don't know I, I don't need you don't need that unless you might be Russian or something that looks kind of Russian, I don't know. Now all you have to do next is very simple. All you have to do is just connect your pocket PC to your computer using Microsoft Active Sync. Click on Explore. Now next is you can save the, all you need is this cap file, okay? You can save it onto wherever you want on your Windows mobile device. You can put it on your built-in storage or your my documents, your flash cards or whatever. I'm going to be putting it in my SD card. Just click on it, drag it in there, but I'm not going to be doing that. I already have it, so I don't need to do it. Now, once you've done that, just go to your files and just locate it wherever you saved it at, and then just click on it, and it's going to start. And I'm going to be showing you this on my Dell Axiom over here. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so you extracted the 
which one file already and drag the top file onto the Windows Media device and install it. Now, there's also another step for this that you're also going to need to do in order to get the, to clean up the file, the program. But it's going to be using, when you go to the YouTube website, it's going to be using this file, the TCTMT or player one. Now, in order to change that, you're going to want to go into the or player. Now, what you're going to do is click on the menu. I mean, you can see that on that because I don't have to be actually with dead in the world, so click on options. Click on options. Oh, no, my bad. Click on tools. Oops, wrong one. You go, click on tools. Yes. How to get you 